a Methodist minister who lost his job after officiating over the marriage of his gay son, speaking out today about his family, the trial that left him defrocked, and how to unite a divided congregation. Reverend Frank Schaefer is coming to La Mesa tonight, where the Methodist Church has been reaching out to the LGBTQ community. Carlos Correa is here with what's becoming a very sensitive subject for the church. Carlos. That's right, Jason. And a good afternoon to you. The National Methodist Church officially states the practice of homosexuality is incompatible with Christian teaching. But over the years, many individual congregations have opened their arms and hearts to the LGBTQ community. Reverend Frank Schaefer. Guilty by a jury of 13 ordained clergy members. Three years ago in a small town in Pennsylvania, Reverend Frank Schaefer made national headlines for a decision that to this day has rocked the United Methodist Church. I knew that there was a chance that um, I could get in trouble, uh, but, you know, I had embraced my son from the time when he came out, and I had affirmed him and, and, and said things like, you know, our church has not gotten this right yet, and we're working on this. But you are a child of God. You are beloved the way you are. God made you the way you are. And this was not a choice. Schaefer officiated over his gay son's marriage. It landed him on trial in the church and ultimately got him defrocked. The story of his fight for what he believes in is captured in a documentary called An Act of Love. It really uh, portrays not only my struggle, but it portrays the struggle in general that we have as a denomination. Even though it's against church law, many ministers in the United Methodist Church have conducted same-sex marriages without penalty. The issue of gay equality is an emotional one within the church, and it's something the congregation continues to battle. There's a movement in the church to try to change the way that we're looking at all of this, and so everybody recognizes that we need to be talking to each other, and they're, you know, it's, it's a, one of those polarized position kinds of things. Members of the Foothills United Methodist Congregation in La Mesa have formed a reconciling fellowship to welcome all residents, gay or straight, to their church. They hope the first step towards being more open is the screening of this film. Most of us know lots of gay people. We don't always know that we know lots of gay people. And, and I think that um, what we're trying to do is just open things up more and more so that people can, can find that there is a deep connection. They already have a deep connection with LGBTQ people. They just don't even know it. Now, after a lengthy investigation, Schaefer was reinstated. He now serves as pastor in the Santa Barbara Area United Methodist Church. An act of love will be screened at the Foothills United Methodist Church tonight at 7. It's free to attend. I'm Carlos Correa, CW6 News.